。抵达马耳他，我们第一个拜访的地点是马丁纳。马丁纳是最早的马耳他手艺和宗教中心。很幸运的，我们有博学多闻的中英文导游做介绍。哎，这是那个麦丁娜的那个主城啊，大家看一下这个墙，这也是阿拉伯的阿拉伯人那时代那个时候建立的啊。然后,后来的话，就是后来人呢，因为就是他不希望我们，因为在这个地方，麦丁娜本来是那个该怎么讲，就是马耳他的第一个首都啊。那后,后来的人就是为了要限制这个首都发展，因为那个骑士团，当骑士团他们来到的时候，他们在瓦雷塔建了一个新的首都，所以他们就把这个地方卡掉了。原先成本是在那个地方。哎，因为后来那个国王呢，他建的那个城堡太大了，一直延伸到过来的地方，所以就把他原先城门卡掉了。大家没看到那块，所以他只好在这地方再开一个新的城门。但是现在城门来不及，不行的时候开的。他为什么会在这护城河里面看到那个橘子呢？最主要就是因为橘子是一个很怕风害的一种植物，啊，一种水果，所以他就把它种在这个地方。What's your name of this palace? Manuel de Villena. It's Villena Palace. So it's called Villena Palace. Villena Palace. Villena Palace. I just want to show you what the palace in those days used to look like in the time of the night. All of the palaces, they have a courtyard where the carriage and horses used to come in. Then you had the stables, the well to, to give the horses a drink. You had the servants' quarters and the kitchen. Then the knights used to live on the first floor, which was called the Piano Nobile, and they used to entertain people on the top floor. We very quickly turned our attention to the young girls in the middle school. We never saw such a beautiful dress, and the original dress that should have been the dress of the young girls. 刚到这，很容易被迷惑的团团转。一会儿我们发现教堂，一会儿又是马车，一会儿又是一条条优美僻静的小巷。